Hi guys, I hope you all are doing good. Uh, in the previous videos, we have covered companies in uh, British Columbia uh, and Ontario, uh, Alberta. And today we are going to talk about the companies in Saskatchewan. So uh, let's get started with it. And uh, if you see the Saskatchewan, it is in the middle of Canada uh, and it is prairie, it is flat land and uh, uh, the weather is very harsh there uh, that's why the population is uh, density is very low uh, but it, it has been really a kind province i would say in terms of uh, uh, inviting new immigrants so lots of uh, indians go there and uh, uh, they f really find difficult to get into the uh, job market in saskatchewan and so I thought that let me uh, do some research and find out the companies, especially for the mechanical engineers, what are the different companies over there so that uh, uh, they can prepare uh, their strategies uh, accordingly. So if you see the Saskatchewan economy, it is purely based on either in agriculture or in the mining. So most of the companies, if you uh, see in detail, they either manufacture uh, equipment related to agriculture uh, or uh, the equipment which are used in the um, mining industries so let's talk about uh, some of them so the first one is uh, crown corporation so uh, the crown corporation is basically the go government sector organization in uh, Saskatchewan so they have uh, a Sask power and Sask energy so sask power is uh, if you want to understand in context of india it is like national thermal power corporation like ntpc so they are the major power uh, producer in uh, saskatchewan so they have the uh, uh, renewable energy they have the thermal energy uh, power plant based on the gas like that and the sask energy is basically in the distribution side of that power which is generated by sask power so both of the Sask Power and Sask Energy hire mechanical engineers, uh, especially you, if you have experience in the plant side uh, or the equipment uh, related to the power plants or the distribution like grid, transformers, uh, switch gears like that. <coughs> and then next one is Sask Water. The Sask Water is more uh, in terms of the wastewater management side. So the mechanical engineering hiring is little less but it is very good opportunity for project managers and civil engineers so you can explore about that the next one is average north america so average north america is basically uh, the uh, steel producer uh, in um, canada uh, they have one plant in um, regina so if you have experience on the uh, still making uh, industries uh, you can think about that like especially on the maintenance and operation side uh, if you have uh, this is going to be the new uh, good industry rather than new good industry for you to start with uh, mosaic the mosaic company is the largest uh, pot potash mining industry in saskatchewan so they have one big office in uh, regina and they have the mines nearby Regina in Belly Plain. So uh, they hired uh, especially for the uh, maintenance and operation uh, for the uh, equipment used in mining site. And uh, if you have experience on HVAC or uh, you, ha you have experience on uh, maintenance site, then this is going to be a really good opportunity for you. The Cargill is also uh, another uh, mining company in uh, Saskatchewan. Nutrien is another uh, big organization uh, in mining and they have a uh, really big team in uh, Saskatoon because Saskatchewan has two big cities Saskatoon and Regina so uh, each of the company has center either in Regina or in uh, Saskatoon so you can explore that. Uh, Camco, Camco is uh, known as the largest uranium mining company in the world and uh, uh, you will be surprised that uh, Saskatchewan has the 
largest uranium mining uh, industry in northern side of Saskatchewan. Uh, then next one is Vitera. Vitera is basically a company uh, in agri business. So all the uh, like food processing industries like uh, pulses, uh, uh, I think uh, then all the oil seeds, right? Oil seeds uh, and then other food packaging industries. So the Camco, is, uh, sorry, Vitra is well known for that, and then CNH Industrial. So CNH Industrial is uh, basically the automotive equipment manufacturer, uh, which are used mostly on the agriculture side. So uh, they hire a lot of mechanical engineers. So if you have experience on uh, design engineering side, you please think about that. And sometimes. Uh, they outsource their work to TCS, Infosys, and uh, sometimes Tech Mahindra. So, if you guys have background from these consultancies like Infosys, TCS, and Tech Mahindra, uh, try to connect with your colleague and uh, your managers. And if you have already moved to in Canada, uh, this is going to be really helpful for you to uh, get into these industries uh, through your old network. And then next one is Fortis Corporation. Fortis Corporation is in the uh, gas distribution like LPG gas, right, in India. Uh, like that, uh, Fortis Corporation is more on the utility side, utility businesses. So they have the uh, gas connections, gas distributions, uh, like that. So if you have experience on that side, uh, think about it. And they have uh, opportunity not only in Saskatchewan, but uh, all over across the uh, western and middle side of uh, uh, Canada. Uh, and then next one is uh, Federated Cooperative Limited. We call it Co-op in uh, Saskatchewan, C-O-O-P. Uh, so they have uh, a retail chain as well as uh, they have the uh, oil and gas refineries. So Co-op refinery is in Regina. So if you have experience in oil and gas side, this is going to be the a good opportunity for you. Uh, the next one is Husky Energy. Husky Energy is uh, again like private player who is in the thermal power uh, production, uh, similar to like uh, you said Adani Power or Reliance Power, right? So like that. And the next one is Brandt Group of company. So Brandt Group is very big company in Regina uh, for mechanical engineer especially if you have experience on mechanical design side. Uh, this is going to be really good company for you. They are uh, in the custom uh, made product design actually. So they cater agriculture sector, automotive sector, mining, etc. So all those sectors, major, major sector in the Saskatchewan, they basically fulfill the requirement of product design like that. Dyna Industrial is another uh, uh, good company for mechanical engineers. They they are in the agriculture and automotive side. Uh, the next one is advanced engineered product. So by name it itself, right? Engineered product. So they are the custom uh, product design and the manufacturer. They have the uh, office in Saskatoon. So uh, you can uh, have a look at it into that. HD engineering is again. Uh, uh, design consultant, I would say, and they hire a lot of mechanical engineers, especially in the CAD uh, CAD side. If you have experience, so uh, HD engineering is a really good oppor opportunity for you. Uh, Degelman Industries and Design Development Limited and Drivekar Industries Limited. These three are uh, in the uh, again equipment designer and manufacturer for all the agriculture equipments. Uh, Morris Industries and Dumur and Dutch Industry. They are small fabricators. They have small, small facilities in Regina. So uh, if, if you have experience on the small shop or manufacturing side, you can think about that. And they hire uh, mechanical engineers, quality engineers, uh, like that. And uh, Rockford Engineering Works and Kua Engineering Limited. These two are uh, basically uh, started by those people who were previously in brand industries. So they are alumni of brand industry. They resigned from there and then they started their own business. 
So, they again do the custom product uh, similar to the brand, uh, but they have very good reputation in what they do. So, uh, if you are mechanical engineers, especially uh, in the mechanical design side, please consider Rockford Engineering Works Limited and Coa Engineering Limited. The Coa Engineering Limited also has uh, office in British Columbia in Vancouver. So, you can follow them uh, closely and they keep uh, publishing the new opportunity on their website. And now, let us talk about some consultancy organizations which is uh, in the Saskatchewan. So, I will quickly uh, tell about them uh, because some of the organization we have previously uh, covered in the uh, other province video. So, All North Consultant as I said the previously they are in more on um, uh, infrastructure or civil infrastructure development side. Uh, so, they hire mostly in, uh, people uh, experience on the project engineering side or piping P and ID experience if we have this is going to be good opportunity. Uh, GCM consultant is basically based on Montreal, but they have satellite office in Regina also. So, they take projects from the mining industries and oil refineries. So, if you have experience on those two industries, GCM consultant might have experience, might have vacancies for project engineers. So, keep eye on that. And next one is March Cons Consulting Associate Inclusive. So, March Consulting Associates Inclusive uh, is a consultant who cater different industry, wide range of industries uh, in agriculture, mining, uh, infrastructure development or any other uh, wherever uh, the customer has an issue, March consult Consulting uh, help them in electrical, in mechanical, in the project management side. And the best part is the CEO of uh, March Consulting is Indian um, uh, origin lady Ritu Malhotra. So, uh, you can go in their website and uh, start following that. Uh, they, they have uh, basically workforce, uh, I would say like diversified workforce, people from different country and different background. So, this is really a uh, good pick uh, f to start uh, your job in Saskatchewan. Next one is Stantec, which we have uh, talked about uh, a lot in um, the different videos. And uh, next one is uh, West Corp Solutions. So, this is again a consultant uh, who basically take project, especially on the project management side uh, for uh, the mining industries uh, to help them out. And the wood is uh, known, uh, very uh, well known actually in the mining and the nuclear energy side. We have talked uh, in video of Ontario about that. Uh, and then let us talk about a uh, couple of consultant uh, recruitment agencies which can help you guys to uh, get break into workforce in Saskatchewan. So, the first one is uh, ADECO. ADECO is very well reputed uh, 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 outsourcing organization in Canada. They have office in uh, Saskatoon as well as in Regina. They help people to uh, get place in Sask Power, Sask Energy, Sask Water like that. So, if you are not getting opportunity directly to the uh, Crown Corporation, you can go through ADECO. So, what ADECO does is they hire people on their own payroll and then they put uh, into Sask Power and Sask Energy. Sometimes, uh, those crown corporation absorb those uh, people. And then next one is uh, Employment Network Canada. Uh, this is uh, a placement agency uh, who help people to uh, get job in um, Sask Saskatchewan uh, job market. Hughes Recruitment, Lake Search Group and uh, David Appline Group. These are the couple of consultancy uh, organizations uh, which can help you to get into the job market. So, these are some of the companies guys, uh, I will give the link of all these companies in the web, uh, in the description below. Uh, go and explore, uh, try to connect to, with the people from this organization through LinkedIn, uh, start uh, learning about their work, uh, what kind of skills they typically look, do not directly ask for job, uh, it, it does not look good. Uh, so, try to avoid that and uh, try to showcase your skills, what kind of projects you guys have done, try to make uh, a small portfolio and send across to them. 
uh, after discussion with them like what kind of job they do and try to uh, adapt your portfolio to suit their requirement and then um, uh, try to impress from your work that uh, uh, they can you can be really helpful uh, to solve their problems so if they find useful they will definitely consider you but uh, again uh, is i always say that uh, you can connect with them you can interact with them but don't apply with the job if you are not in canada uh, because i don't want you to lose the opportunity uh, just because you are not in canada right so uh, if you are planning to come in canada uh, try to keep this comp this company uh, is your target company and uh, uh, keep studying them try to develop your skills to suit uh, those uh, uh, requirements and then that will be easy for you in saskatchewan people have little bit kind of hesitation in terms of hiring the new immigrants because it has been historically uh, the case that people uh, migrate to uh, saskatchewan but over the period of time they move out of that because of the harsh weather so employer think that uh, if new, they hire new immigrant they are not going to stay there for a long time but that is not the case actually i would say in uh, regina there is huge indian population uh, and they have uh, established themselves really nice so try to interact with them show your interest and then you will be uh, good to that it takes time to break the ice but it is not impossible so i wish you all the best and uh, if you guys are watching this video and any of your friends or relatives are already in saskatchewan please share this videos to with them so that uh, they can have uh, information and they can prepare their strategies so thank you so much guys for uh, watching this video please like and subscribe and share uh, this video and uh, let's meet in next video for talking about couple of more job opportunities Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Have a great day. Bye-bye.